Hello viewers! This is a tutorial about a program I found called the PMD Size Changer. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to load up a regular Miku model. I want to load this up so that I can compare what I'm going to show you later after using the PMD Size Changer. Now the PMD size changer is where I'm going to next, and it is a EXE file, an executable file. You just double click it and it pops up, and it asks you to choose a model, and after you choose a model, it'll uh, give you the option to change the name of the model and the size of the model. Ignore what's happening right here because I'm choosing the wrong model and I have to go back double click it again and now I'm going to the same model that I just loaded up the Miku model and there it is the top line is the name of the model and the bottom line right there the 1.0 is the size of the model 1.0 is the default size I'm going to change it to 2 which is double the size now it's going to ask me to save it I'm going to save it and call it test just for this purpose you can call it anything you want now I'm going to go to Miku Miku Dance and load up a model file and I'm going to load up that test model file that I just saved through the PMD size changer. And here it is and boom! Look at that! Twice the Miku! Now the the problem with this is that once you use this program, the outcome model, or whatever you call it, has no physics. And it just kills them. You can tell right now, I've turned the physics on real time, and uh, there's no movement at all. Whereas the regular model, well, she's just fine. Alright, now I'm going to wipe this clean. And show you something else you can do with it, and any other PMD file for that matter. I'm going to load up a tank file, and we're going to change the size of that. Now, this is something that'll give Len nightmares, I guarantee it. Just to go through it again, you double click the PMD size changer. It takes you to uh, the folders to decide which PMD file you want to change. Top is the name of the file, bottom is the size of the file. I'm going to put it at 5, which is 2.5 times bigger than the normal one. And then you save it. And then you go to Miku Miku Dance, load up what you just saved, and here we go. As you can see, the bones and everything work just fine. So, there it is. Have fun with it, guys.